Sean Brooks, but this is one of Kaizen's up and coming guys with a 1-0 record already. But let's see if Brooks can get him to the ground. Wow, fast. Look start. at this quick, I told you. And, and, I, and I don't know how to tell you this, but the, everybody always thinks the taller guy in the MMA fight always turns out better, but this, to me, it's always been the shorter guy. Leverage. Oh, good. Good up kick yeah. from Kim. This should be fun to watch. Both fighters toe to toe, the Iron Man. Brooks in the blue corner. Andrew Kim out of Kaizen, fighting in the red. Oh, good right hand from Brooks. You know, as I was walking out of the cage, Kevin, uh, Sean said, I think he was telling me he doesn't go by the Iron Man anymore, so yeah. I don't know okay. what happened with his nickname. Tell him, tell him not to put it on his <laughs> sheet. Exactly. <laughs> but, all right, so Kim looks a little more comfortable now. Yeah, uh, we'll get Brooks is in, getting in close now. Look, this is what I thought would happen. I thought Brooks would want to get him to the ground. Good, tight clinch. Look at that, good blocks by him. Did you see that? Brooks had both of oh! oh, he's knocked him. Oh, he's out. He's done. He's done. It's over. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Wow, look at Brooks. Is like, I'm not good. He was. He had no idea where he was. Wow. Right to left from Andrew Kim. Brooks is still like, what wow. happened? But Brooks, you know, you're not all right. He's telling wow. his corners he's all right. Wow. Wow. What a great, great fight. This place just went crazy. <laughs> the whole VIP section is on their feet, Kevin. Unbelievable. <laughs> Andrew oh. Kim caught him with a left and then a right and knocked Brooks to the ground. Now, Brooks, I thought, was unconscious for a second, but then he woke he, up. He flat, it's called a flash knockout. And he, he was done. Wow. Unbelievable. Andrew Kim comes away with a quick knockout here in the sixth or the seventh fight of this evening's Cagezilla 44. Chris will make his way up to the cage, but man, that was unbelievable. Fun to watch. Andrew Kim, what an up-and-comer. Now, he's very tall for this weight class, and he dropped down a weight class from middleweight to go ahead and fight Sean Brooks tonight. He just, he was just, that was just quick and strong, and I think Sean Brooks is okay, but he had no idea where he was. He's still trying to catch himself. That was something special to watch. Great job, and I'm gonna tell you what, Sean Brooks will be back. Now, he's gonna have a record of three and three, but Sean Brooks is no slouch. Just Andrew Kim, this guy dropping down the fight and just, just came out and, I mean, just put it on him. But I thought Brooks was gonna be the, the I'm telling you, height in this MMA fight doesn't normally mean wins, and a lot of people think that. Sean Brooks could have got in there a little bit closer, got in tight, got into the ground, and stayed on the ground with him. Kim caught him on an up kick, but I'm gonna tell you, Sean Brooks, I think we'll see lots more of him. Let's throw it up to Chris Fuller so we'll get the call. All right, ladies and gentlemen, the referee has called a stop to the action just 56 seconds into the very first round. For your winner, by knockout, in the red corner, it's Andrew Kim. Well, there you see it, Andrew Kim by knockout, 56 seconds into round number one. What a great job by the Kaizen MMA tonight and Andrew Kim. When we come back, it's the title fight. Sonny Amotep versus Sal Hierro right here at Kate Zilla.